All right, boys, today is the day that we do the prison escape. Between now and the last episode, I've been kind of coming up with a few things. I have a plan pretty much put together. I just need to sort a few things out. Uh, I've also been selling a few more drugs. And as you can see, I've got like a little farm going on here with like a few plants going on. So I've been making some money, but I real quick just need to go over to Zeno's shop in order to get a few more things for this plan. Yo, bro. Hello there. How's it going? I heard you were stopping by. Yeah, so about yesterday, I've come up with like a decent enough plan. I'm just going to need to buy a phone and some binoculars if that's okay. I got you. Uh, that'll be 50 for the phone and uh, 20 for the binoculars. All right, you can keep the change. Okay, that's Thank you very cover. much. Yeah, so about the escape, I have like a mm -hmm. plan almost finalized. If you want to swing by my cell in like an hour, bring as yep, many I people as you can that. because we're going to need numbers if we're going to do this. All right, we'll try to ring up some numbers on the way there. All right, nice one. I'll see you soon. Okay, meet you then. All right, I think he is probably fine, right? Yo, Justin, you hear me right now? This is a ring a ring a ring a ring a ding ding. Static issues right now and voice. Yeah, I'm not really having the best of uh, connections and I don't really have long. I'm gonna need you to do me a favor. As you probably realized, I got caught. However, me and a few guys in here have uh, got a little, well, it's quite an extensive plan to get out of here. So uh, I'm gonna need your help though, if you're up for it. I just need you to pay me a visit as a normal visitor, but we're gonna need to smuggle some things in. All I need is some clothing. Just as much clothing as you can get. It sounds weird, but if you can get me that, I might be seeing you very soon. Uh, this is sound alright, well, what, um, hmm. Any. Literally any sort of clothing will do. How are we gonna smuggle that in? Well, it's not exactly contraband here. You know, you can have, like, pajamas and stuff, so even if we have to smuggle it, like, if the guards say no, we'll, we need to find a way to get that in here, because that is the only way that we're getting out of here. Alright, I'm gonna start heading down to the shops and just see what old they don't need. Yeah, that sounds brilliant. Hey there, Gerd. Where's your day going? Yep, that's fine, that's fine. Okay, I gotta go, this guard's about. Duncan, he's got a visitor. Yeah. Oh. How does this work with visiting and... Am I allowed to, like, come out here um, and... We wait for him here, he's in the parking lot. There he is. Hey, how you doing? Well, I've been a lot better, I must admit. But, uh, it's nice to see a familiar face, not gonna lie. Did you All get right, the uh, the comfy pajamas I asked for? Oh yeah, I got your pajamas. Uh, let me... Nice. I even got a I even got a extra parents for the other prisoners in case they were interested. Oh, that's really thoughtful of you. Yeah, I, I made some friends in here, so I'm sure they'll really appreciate that. Well, can you can you let me check that real quick? Oh yeah, okay. Just pure pajamas, my yeah, guy. Just pajamas. Let's see. Just pajamas. Uh, I don't know how long we have to talk. Uh, yeah, I don't think we got long, but, um, I'm just gonna say this one thing. The spot when the sun goes down. That's all, that's all I can say right now. Alright, get back in the prison. Alright, Justin, it's been lovely speaking right, to you. Well, I hope that luck. I can see you again soon. You won't be seeing him for a while. Ah, uh, well, you know, we'll see about that. What, <laughs> we just gonna get to our players, what's going on? Okay, so I don't... <laughs> I don't know why he's just got me all green, but that'll do. See, the guards think I'm just getting some comfy pajamas, but that ain't the case. See, my plan with these is to make just a few things. There we go. Perfect. All right. I might need some more rope, actually. Hold on. Okay. This is everything we need to escape. And since the guards already checked my box, it should be fine just waiting here for a little bit. Hey, Duncan, this is as much as I can get. Oh, wow. Okay, you actually did get quite a crew then. Okay, nice. Yeah, this is actually uh, a nice amount of people. All right. 
I guess I'll get up here like a little stage and I will uh, explain the plan that I have come up with. So when I first got transported here on the bus, I noticed outside there was a little control box. That control box seems to control the front gates, the ones leading to the prison. However, it doesn't control the main gates on the wall. There's a little booth with a guy in there that controls those gates. I'm thinking if we can access that box, we can force these gates to open and we can just run free. The only thing is we're going to need to time it with the bus coming in because the front gate needs to open and then we need to do it. So we need to time it right. The weakest point of the prison is probably outside in the yard and we need to really get the roof access in order to get to the box. So this is where I need your guys' help. So is there anyone here that owns any of these cells on the upper floor? I own that one. I own the right corner. Okay, that's that's perfect actually. So if I give you this, a big long bit of okay. rope, on my signal, you're going to need to drop it out of your window and into the yard so that I can climb it to then get onto the roof. And then when I destroy the box, the Ooh. gates will open and we all run out. We're probably going to need some guns to do this. I figured we may as well try and get access to the armory. And to do that, we're no. going to need a distraction. And this is where you come in, Zeno. I know that you have some firecrackers yep. and stuff. If we can make like a little makeshift yep. device that creates a lot of sound, like an explosion, I reckon that'll get all the guards. I can definitely do that. If we stick that in the kitchen, all the guards will come rushing in. We could probably lure one of them away, uh, take his key, and then while they're distracted, uh -huh. I'll try and get as many guns as possible for us. Um. And yeah, that's pretty much the plan. There is a tower out front, but I figured the guard up there will be distracted pretty easily by the bus coming in. He'll just turn his mm -hmm. attention to the bus. I'm thinking we can maybe take that guard out for extra safety because uh, he probably will open fire on us if he oh, yeah. us with weapons. Definitely, but like I say, I mean, the bus comes only 24 hours, so we have basically only have one shot at doing this. Yep. As soon as that bus comes, those gates open, I'm going to climb up to the roof. I'll have like a few seconds of the guard looking away. I'm going to open the gates. You guys can run out and you can take out the guard and do whatever. And then we're just going to book it for the front gates and uh, hope that we can get out. So basically, that is the plan. If we want to get some like makeshift grenades or whatever ready, we can yep. go and distract the guards because the bus is due in yep. pretty soon. So we need to act kind of fast. Cool. Right, Let's well, do this, uh, boys. If you guys want to head over to my cell in subblock B, we can definitely get that uh, firecracker makeshift grenade. All right, cool. Let's do it. All right. I'm going to get this uh, can, some of these nails, and make this thing. All righty. See, the towers at the back shouldn't be too much of a problem since we're going out the front, so yep. it's just that front tower we need to make sure is distracted. Is this good? That seems perfect to me. Do you want to do this? Okay, let's do it. All right. All right, guys, once you guys do this, there's no going back, so just so you know. All right, where do you yeah, want to throw it? I think that's perfectly fine. Uh, anyway, so long as you can get away fast before the guards see. <laughs> come on, come on, come on, come on. Yeah, they're going, they're going. Hey, officer. Um, there was an explosion that just happened. I think it came from like this cell yeah, over here. I think it was just- You know what that explosion was? <laughs> nice, nice. Okay, get the key, get the key. All right, boys, I've got the key. Um, I, I think the gun. rest of the guards are distracted. I'm gonna real quick, yeah, hide the gun. I'm gonna try and get access to the armory while there's no one there. And uh, I'll be back. I'll be back. All right. Okay, we'll watch. Okay. Okay, we should be fine. <gasps> there you go. Get him in the back. Get him in the back. Okay, I did not expect there to be a guy there. I need to shut all these doors. Okay, it looks... Oh! <sighs> Don't come here. Don't come here. Okay, he's gone. Okay, I think I'm good for now. I need to be really fast. There is so much stuff here, but we just need to get completely armored up for everybody. Uh, I'm just going to take everything. Everything I can, at least. Okay, I'm definitely going to need some tasers. That could come in handy a little bit, I guess. Whatever that is. Uh, can I even fit? Oh, I can. This backpack's so big. Look at this. 
this thing? What is this? Okay, I can hear guards coming again. I'm gonna need to be really fast. All right, I've got a backpack full of stuff, but I need to get this back to the prisoners before any of the guards come. Boys, 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 come on, come on. Hey, you got the gun? I did indeed. Everyone just needs to hide your guns. I'm gonna go back to my cell, but we need to meet in the courtyard very, very soon. Yeah. Rope guy, if you can go to your cell and be in position, ready for me to tell you to drop the rope, then I'm gonna give you this key because when the front gate's open, you're gonna need it to unlock the lobby to let everybody out. Okay, so you're in charge of letting okay. everybody out. All right, cool. Meet me in the courtyard very soon. Okay, it's almost time. I think we should probably start going now, actually. Yo, boys. Where's everybody else? Oh, you tell me. Oh, they better not be late, bro. We need to- we only have one chance at this. The bus only comes once and it's gonna be here in like a few minutes. Well, I'm locked and ready. Okay, they're here, they're here. Hello, boys. Alright, everyone got the guns? Yep. Okay, rope guy's up there. We're ready to do this? All right, yeah, throw I'm it ready. now. Throw it now. Yeah, there's the guard. There's the gates, perfectly timed. I really hope this works. All right, boys, you can run for it, run for it, run for it. I'll try to try cover right now. Okay. them. I feel kind of bad just using the prisoners as uh, as my key to escape, but here we are. I just hope Justin uh, knows to get to the spot. Oh, that's a helicopter. Okay, I don't know how I'm going to get past these. There's just a big open field in front of me. Bro, look at all those cars. Oh my goodness. They're putting on like a like a huge search or something for all the convicts. Okay, this is gonna be difficult. Another helicopter, are you kidding me? Yeah, they're just circling, trying to search for people by the looks of it. Oh no, I don't think he's here yet. Justin, are you here? Oh, oh boy, you scared the life out of me, man. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> All right. 
tank, tank things. We gotta get going. Okay. We are in the middle of pretty much a city-wide and just outside the city. Oh, hold on, hold on, hold on. Turn that off. I didn't tell you. Yeah, that, there's been helicopters circling around. There's been cars, like police cars, going everywhere trying to find me. Um, in fact, there's one over there right now. I don't, like, yeah, it was quite a big escape. I don't really know. Um, I, I don't know how many got out. I definitely saw a couple. It's going to make a great story when we get back. Yeah, the uh, question is, do you, do you think we'll now? be able to? Like... Yeah, okay. Do you think we'll be able to get there just in your truck, just like without looking suspicious? <laughs> Probably, right? Okay, just... I'll keep the headlights off until we're back on the road. The thing is, it's like middle of the night, so a car driving is, is already suspicious. But yeah. we, we should be fine. We'll we just be try fine. and look as normal as possible. Just, 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 you're just normal. You're just going normal. We're just normal. Don't, don't mind us. This is insane. This is insane. If you're going, I asked to pull over, you know what? I'll give you my zipper lighter, you can burn off your prints. So they can't <laughs> look at all the cop cars behind us, bro. This is insane. So many people out looking for us. So did um, did everyone else make it out? So as far as I know, they're all parted ways, but we still have their contacts. They're still active, but it sounded, you know, it's, things haven't sounded the most stable. It's not a little bit sketchy, but I'm not questioning anything. Okay, um, okay. We've we have cashed out most of most of the money, so it's just there to be collected and shared upon everyone. Else. Yeah, well, I think uh, I'm going to try get back to the boss man's house and, uh, you know, hopefully everything can blow over. We can just count the money and, uh, you know, maybe even treat ourselves because I think after all this, we deserve that. When we when we get back, I need to hear this full story. I want to know all the cry crazy shenanigans you got up to. Oh, boy, I will tell you it all. Don't you worry.